In this tutorial, I'll be showing you the basics of sewing. Before you can start sewing, you have to set up your machine. Each machine is a little different, but the important features are usually the same. Make sure you follow the instructions that came with your machine. I'll be using Genome's Hello Kitty. A bobbin is basically a small spool of thread that goes inside your machine. Each sewing machine should come with bobbins that are made specifically for that machine. Turn the hand wheel to lift the needle to its highest point. Then pull out the hand wheel to lock the machine in wind mode. The bobbin is located inside the shuttle. Pull the lever and you should find the bobbin inside this case. Place your spool of thread on the spool pin, with the thread coming from behind the spool towards your right. Loop the thread as it's shown in your instruction manual. Mine goes around these two. Insert the thread through the hole of the bobbin from inside to out. Place the bobbin on the bobbin winder and set it to winding mode by switching it over to the setting closest to this knob. Hold the extra string until the thread catches in the bobbin. Wind as much as you need or until the bobbin is full. The bobbin will automatically switch off when it is full. Cut off any extra thread. With the little extra thread hanging off, place the bobbin back inside the bobbin case with the thread going counterclockwise. Take the extra thread and pull it through the slot. Take the bobbin case and place it back in the shuttle. Turn the hand wheel again until you see the take up line. Take the thread from the spool and bring it down and around the machine. Many machines will have pictures to show you how to do this. Thread the needle. Pull the needle thread to the side and turn the hand wheel one full turn. This will bring the bobbin thread up. Now you are ready to sew. Take two pieces of cloth with the right sides facing together. Pin down to keep them together and align. Push in the hand wheel to unlock your machine. Pull the extra thread to the side and put down the presser foot. Remember to backstitch at the start and finish to lock in your stitches. You can do this by pressing down the pedal and holding the reverse sewing button.
loop the presser foot and cut off any extra thread. Unpin the fabric and there you go. Hope this helps. Happy sewing and see you next time.